What's up guys, Chris Sonic here, and we are back for another NBA 2K19. And I hope you enjoyed playing, joining with us with the, the Gasol brothers, the San Antonio Spurs versus against the Memphis Grizzlies. And now, our next team, we are going to see our next team from the NBA 2K19. As we are about to be seeing, the one of the toughest team that I wanted to know is who who would I want to pick if it is a narrow one. So there is there is no way we have seen the players before. Then the only one from the Uncle Drew part, Kyrie Irving, the Boston Celtics, going to take on against Rudy Gobert, the Utah Jazz. And even though they have never just won that before. We are going to make this one into a city, and this one by Earn. I'm sorry, uh, let's try uh, and this one by City, too. As we, so we can get two of these cities and see what we could do right now. But right now, I am on the Utah side, and somebody will be on the Boston Celtics. So it's Kyrie Irving's team versus... It's Kyrie Irving's team versus Go Bears team. Now, without further ado, let's get started the, the NBA 2K pregame show. It's the 2K Sports pregame show. Good evening, sports fans. This is 2K Sports. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny Smith. Tonight, we'll be watching the Utah Jazz playing against the Boston Celtics. Looking at Boston, playing above 500 in the last few weeks, not bad. They'd like to do better. We'll see if they can add a win tonight. Well, tonight we're going to get to see Kyrie Irving. Plenty of debate over where he stands among the best point guards That's in right. the league. Kyrie Check, Irving. where do you put him? Well, first of all, I don't have G14 classification to talk about guards because I'm the ultimate big man. He's in the top handful. Westbrook and Curry are still probably ahead of him. But again, I don't have that classification. But my good friend Kenny does. Well, as a scorer and a ball handler, Kyrie can hold his own with anybody. And he brings that high entertainment value. Is that entertaining? Is that entertaining? That's entertainment. No. Um, nope. Sorry. Thanks for joining us. We'll try to do better the next Try time. again there, Kenny the Jet Smith. And now, let's go right into the Vivint Smart Home Arena. 2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. So, here it is at Utah. The look at the sun shining in the buildings of downtown and there Salt they are. Lake City, Utah. They the Salt Lake City, today. Utah, Vivint Smart Home Arena. The crowd is coming here and here's the city court. We never used it before because one of the courts have cities on here. And the Utah Jazz has always made the city court right where it was. The Utah Jazz coming to this one. We got some players here that are ready to get going. So in the last game versus LAC, the Utah Jazz won against the Los Angeles Clippers, 129-120. Um, it was like a tough, harder choice, but it may not never be here. But in that case, I was not here to take a look at it because it was already that late. But in that case, I'll just take a look what that is. Let's go to David Aldridge for our sideline. Thank you, Kevin. Well, Brad Stevens is one of the youngest coaches in the league. At the same time, he's one of the longest tenured coaches in Celtics history. Gary Irving said he brings the ultimate That's Brad Stevens, the head coach you know, of the Celtics. He demands excellence out of you. You want to play for him. Kevin? All right, and here are the starting lineups. Kyrie Irving, Marcus Smart, Tatum, Rozier, and Albert. Mitchell Ingles, O'Neal, Favors, and Rudy Gobert, which will be the starting lineups. Here are the key matchups for the small forwards. Marcus Smart at 36, and number two, Joe Ingles, taking it for the small forward. Okay, folks, looks like it's time for game. Take some notes, Jazz. Good luck. And the Celtics win the tip-off. 
Let's make some aggressive play. Watch this. Uh, watch Kyrie Irving. He's right there. On the court for the shot. He never does that. Al Horford makes that dunk after with the assist by Kyrie Irving. That play is made because of Kyrie Irving. Right, Mitchell. Mitchell passes up to Gobert. Ingles saves it by Ingles. Shot fake. Ingles makes a three. So that makes up three to two in the lead. Now here's Kyrie. Come on. Gobert turns it over. Oh, here's another three. He's got it. Own it. And now Irving back up. Irving finds Most Irving. City fans really want them to be hard and struggle. Tatum against but they got to get back up where it was. And the bucket from Tatum. Now Tatum awesome. gets that shot. This season he got that. Points and reach. And what he's doing out there. Watching some screens here. Irving against Mitchell. Irving versus Mitchell, right over to uh, Favors, Mitchell, nice and nice down, two point shots, number 45. And right there, Donovan Mitchell showing off. And because you know, they're, they're, they're tough teams, you know, you can pick which one it is better. You don't know if it's going to be the Jazz, you don't know if it's going to be the, the Celtics. Four for taking the three, but it missed the shot. O'Neal recovers the ball. The other way. O'Neal up top. O'Neal go up by Gobert. Gobert with the pass to O'Neal. So dish the papers. Try to make some screen, but the shot clock running down. On the wing again. The and too good. That was by O'Neal, number 23. The Celtics have gone two or three here to start out the game. Steve, the golden era of basketball for the Jazz, were in the late 90s. Morris, Malone. What was Marcus Morris. Against those teams? Well, they were unguardable in a pick and roll. Screen. Fantastic in the past race. Morris taking the two Malone points out of a layup for the, the assist. Position. And then you had John Stockton. If you made a mistake, now here's Mitchell. Mitchell will gonna go down. Probably would have won a title if oh, Jordan O'Neal. Oh, someone's lucky. Following the basket by Marcus Morris. Now Eagles go to O'Neal. He won't be able to take that shot, but Ingles will. Shot, I post. Unfortunately, Ingles can't make the shot. It's no, it's not in a good place. Strong start. Tatum. Tatum. That shot, that shot no good. Favors picks a rebound. Invite it to Mitchell. They turn around. Mitchell against Irving. Mitchell. Mitchell's good! So you see Donovan Mitchell, he has his best points in this, in this season, or right now his last season. It was off. Oh, somebody's off. But Irving missed the shot. Oh, looking for the open man. But in last season, he played really well, trying to look for open off offense in the man. Oh, stay away for this three second violation. And another one for number 15. Now the timeout will be the Celtics. Now as you see Donovan Mitchell, he's doing really well in this game. As you can see, he's doing a great job. And he's never back in again. So as you can see right now, where are we looking? As you're looking for our fan favorite, Ricky Rubio, Unfortunately, Ricky Rubio is not here, and he is out of the game. Darn it. But with that being said, I'm not going to switch this players yet. A different look for Utah. So we have a different look for Utah and the Celtics. Morris Tatum Smart subs out. And a new group is here. Brown Hayward and Tice. Fives now. This will be Brian Reveal. Favors. We know Crowder and Corfer. Who's got traded from the uh, Cleveland Cavaliers. Corfer makes a rebound and now he'll turn around the other way. Now Corfer. Corfer trying to look for an offense. 
much do you know? Not making the illegal shift this time. Mitchell outside. Right outside, and Mitchell. Mitchell, foul call, and one! Terry Rozier takes the first foul. Giving up far too many. And Brad Stevens says, rhythm. What is going on with you? People's on offense. They better He's stop. The part, one of the better Try to trap them, the not just foul them. Yep, see? The foul and one. That's like a Feature teammate that makes the top. play. Mitchell was awesome. a late riser on most people's boards. And right now, Mitchell will take one shot, number 45. One shot, gentlemen. One shot, gentlemen. Easy. Here it comes. Free throw dropped for Mitchell. That's a good one for Mitchell. Discussion that the NBA has become less yeah, as you can see right now, we got seven, one, a minute and a half to go, 17 to six, still in the lead for Jazz. Freedom of movement. So, what will happen to that play? I can't, I can't remember what that happened already. Post that job, making that up to Udo. Udo, right over to Corfer. Corfer taking a two. He can't make a shot, so Hayward rebounds the ball after he makes the shot. Ogier. Ogier missed the shot. Crowder with the rebound. But I think under the rules, the referees have to call these plays because there's no handshake. Now here's Crowder. Crowder over to Eagles. Eagles makes the layup. And Crowder, as you can see, 23 points and when you last time with the win. Like this, and he put up so many assists that he could have used. Against the letdown. So, yeah, this is you guys watched the game before, just make sure you, you miss the game. For the it's your favorite team. He's watched the uh, Jazz versus the Clippers. They can use a bucket. For the replay. And it goes on a bucket. Jazz ball. 29.5 seconds to go. And George Crowder. 19 6. Bring it up for the Utah Jazz. Here's that the shift. It's screen, but Brown now. turns over. Oh, here comes, here comes Rozier. Look at this block. Oh, but he couldn't get that another successful block. And he will make that shot in. 17.2 seconds. Going down to 13 seconds. Somebody is cold. Rozier. Crowder. Five seconds. Outside corner. Quarter three. In the corner, it's Udo. Launches a three. Three. And we'll get it up to make a buzz here. So that's the end of the first quarter. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back right after this message. So, so stay with us, fans. And now what we need to talk about, about Al Horford, why he did his success. What put me over the, the edge to make this switch is just uh, the depth that I saw with this team. It's an up-and-coming young team that we have a chance to be good for many, many years. And it was something I wanted to be a part of. Playing for a historic franchise. Well, that's like playing for his most career, a couple seasons, but support he may be history. doing it really well. Now, Utah taking the ball after the and now the second quarter has begun. Udo. Udo against Horford. Right over to Crowder. Crowder missed the shot. Looking for an open contest shot. Neck and neck, but neck and neck. Horford! Oh my! Fan you see that sl team. slam dunk? That's how he made that shot of why he made a decision yeah, it's been the instead of a Atlanta the Hawks this time. Shot fake right over to uh, the left side. Mitchell, it's good. So Mitchell had versus the Celtics. Nine points. Celtics picks up ten points. But he might want to take another lead before he gets too close. He has an NBA and a Oh, Udo picked up the foul, number 33. the team perfectly. And Stevie talk about Snyder's intensity perhaps has one of the sternest faces. So let's watch Rozier again. I think so. Yep, he's putting up the uh, arm almost right into his face. Put up a nose. Yep, that's his first personal foul. Udo. 
And number 12, Terry Rogier, the fur. Come on, we've got the Jazz to take notes. First free throw is free throw is good. Bobert is checked in and for you. Bobert. Jason Tatum, he's checked in for Tatum some. is checked it in to Al Horford. And we and Udo is subbed in for Gobert. Come on, take the notes, yes. And so two, from the line. two free throws get a bit. Looking up to 12, 21 to 12. Whoa, looking lucky. Rui Gobert. Gobert finds Corver. Over to Corver. Corver cannot find somebody. Here's Crowder. But he found Crowder. Shot pick again. Mitchell. Good. It's good. And he's on streak because he's found an open man. But now he found it. And now the Boston will take their second timeout. Celtics decide to talk it over. And we'll talk it over. Didn't there, Steve, to draw and and yeah, I gotta make some decisions right now. So before I get back in, Marcus Cousins down because he's a center. used to see center. Let me go ahead and make some game plans. We need some like half court. We need to. Uh, we have to make some three two zones. Marcus Smart. We had your family. Let me make some limit transitions. And, and those guys are tough guys. We gotta make some the average here. Focus on get the shooter for Mitchell. And then the defensive will take the auto. Crash the glass. Play physical. Let's focus on Jason Tatum for now. And we need some force jumper to make. Um, this one. Even middle, under, switch, soft hedge, and front. Actually, let's just get going because for you I am almost out of time. Comes in for Joe I'm not going to make it. I'm, I'm just making some as suggestions here. Okay. Smart comes in and Favors picked it up with their turnover. The second time. Crowder for three. He missed the shot and off the target. And now Tatum will go by. Outside Irving. Irving. In the corner, smart with it. Uh, smart. Yes. He's got the three. The and there's 23 to 15. The and he's on the board to the make three. that point a lot harder. Two. Two. Oh, Donovan Mitchell. I don't think he may not use it. Bear makes one. No fouls in the play. He's got the shot. Now this so that's why Gobert makes that. He's doing really well. I think Donovan Mitchell will do better. Sorry for Ricky Rubio, but looks like the Jazz are picking up well. Jason Tatum, no good. Now Crowder will take the rebound. And now the Gobert will take another one. Here comes Crowder. Crowder for two. And he drops it in. Drops it in for 27 to 15 with 3 minutes and 30, 27 seconds. And so it's in the second quarter of the first half. This game coming on the heels of their winning Morris. Tatum looking for three. Yes, he did. And the Jazz needs to take their timeout, their first timeout, before they can get back on. So I made a, I ran out of time right now, so I want to make sure I want to do some game plans. And now I have to watch. They were suddenly Jason Tatum for two minutes, but he might be the best overall player in that draft. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Okay. First overall, I believe Pete Tatum looks like he could be a two-man action very early in his career. It's a two-man action here, so let's make it easier. Now, Mr. Long will come in, and I'm going to substitute Ingles into Allen. 
player I can uh, substitute. Let's take a look at the players that have been grabbing rebounds in bunches. And take a look at this rebound. The, the leaders, Rudy Gobert has 15.3, tied up with Anthony Davis. And those two, they are looking to have their first win today. But we need some more of these rebounds. We'll make his record of the season. So we'll see what he can do for Rudy Gobert. And right now, here's Allen taking that shot. Favors, shot pick up. Mitchell, another Six shot fake. Allen, time's running out. Yep, yep. it goes in for favors. Watch that. See, the assist, that's what's in there. I love that shot. Great job by favors. Irving kicks to Tatum. Tatum again, missed the shot. Gobert with the rebound, now he'll turn it over. Favors, Tatum with five points, and three points for one and a half. A pass to Mitchell. He will never let this happen. Mitchell Long will kick it. Unfortunately, he can't get it there, so he missed the shot, it's no good. Let's go down to the sideline and catch up with Allen rebounded. I thought somebody had saved this on the offensive side for the Celtics. Sorry about that. Favors. Here comes Favors. Shot pick again. Mitro Long. Allen for two. It's good. 31 to 18 under two minutes. The first half. Now, Kyrie Irving. So Kyrie Irving team won against the Raptors. Like, wow. I thought that the, that the Raptors are going to win, but never mind. The Celtics win it again, and I'm very happy about what they did. Oh, get out of the paint. Mitchell Long. Made a half to go. Donovan Mitchell. Find the shoot. Rudy Gobert, it's good. That's another point for Rudy Gobert. Four points and on the board. And he lost the minus at 13. Celtics are taking the timeout. Time call here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. And they got to talk it over. And the thing about Mitchell stands on the Talk it over. Yeah, that's what I mean. Nah, we don't need anybody going here. Quick off his feet. So it's both teams making So as you see your signature, in a moment here, the that's what they designed the court. And that's what they made. Looks like Kyrie Irving has no problem. Somebody needs to guard on him. Jeez. As you see, uh, as you see the signature, that's the uh, that's the person that creates the uh, basketball court. But the arrows pointing and it made it and design it. Out to the right wing. Now Udo will take it on here. Udo. Ooh. That's good for Gobert. Favor takes a foul, number 20. We've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Yeah, I know. 49.7 to go. And now they put a 35 to 20 over the Celtics. With trailing, with leading by 15. And now Rudy Gobert will take one last look at the shot, one for one. No problem. He makes that shot in. And now they put it in. And they're leading by 16. To the middle. Here's Horford. Horford with that dunk. How could he do that? That was that quick assist from Irving. Udo. Udo shot fake. Ingles. Try to stay away. Here's Ingles. Ingles puts it up. Gobert. And pushing it up. Here's Watch out. Nobody near Irving. Irving misses the shot, and Gobert takes a rebound. Corfer, Corfer takes a shot. It's good. 12 points, four to go in this, the first half. We're almost done with the first half, and then we'll get back into a second half later after halftime. Irving, I want to stop for you. So, oh, someone got lucky. That Irving. 
on deep. That's it. To put it up in time. That's the first half. 38 to 24. That will be their first time to make the lead. That's a great night there. Everything dropping in for them. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Kevin, thanks. Kyle, big Kyle Corfer on the sideline. What's been the difference? Uh, I mean, we're at home, playing with energy. Uh, we knocked down some shots. We can make Points, minutes, but, you know, five we'll, minutes. We'll take a double digit lead for sure. Thank you, Kyle. Appreciate your time. Back to you, Kevin. All right, Thank folks. You. Time for halftime. And we're back with the second half. The third quarter. Welcome back. So we have some technical difficulties with this camera because of the uh, do some recover damage of this data. Take a look back at this one at Joe Ingles. You could see how Joe Ingles makes his shot. And once you see here, once you take a look at down where it was, that part where it was, those motion offense takes a lot much time. And once he passes it up to uh to Crowder. Crowder was saying that he wants to get this player up on in no time. So once he gets there and tries to move forward and then step back and then pass right to Derek Favors. And then once he gets there, Derek Favors, boom. That went for three. And now I need to and now I need to uh, fast forward this so I can get, get this so I don't miss. If you just missed one while the camera was having the difficult time. So hold on just a second here as we go along. And now and now here, Nay, which one I was looking for, looking for the assist, trying to pick that up. And now Ingles right behind there. Take the back screen. Bradley going up. And once Bradley wasn't reaching it, bro. Then Ingles has to take that shot. It's so close, and that contact just goes right in. That's how it does from here to there. And now, and now, as you can see, Gordon Hayward missed that shot, and that shot was like like no good at all. And now back to the other way. Now Bradley picking it up. Okay, so here's Bradley rolling over to, to Favors. This is the state, that was the State Farm assist of the game. And check that out. That was, boom, buckets in here. And that's how it is. Derek Favors, that was the State Farm assist of the game. And now, we'll get started off with the fourth quarter. All moving. So I, I was just checking the replay, so I so you know you all don't and have to miss that. Bonus, time is and now for this here. On the court for the Celtics. And we are almost Bogier done with Brown this quarter. And, and on the lineup, our next and game nice will be the four spot. will and be the Charlotte Hornets taking on against That's good. And it's well, there's Hayward. Hayward. There's, Hayward. there's that the three. He would miss two the shots. For the and now he makes finally makes one in. Hayward made this shot his very first time against the Jazz. Mitchell! Oh my! Roll over the crazy mind. Our next game will be... It will be the uh, Sia... I'm sorry, the... Uh, what do you call it? Tice missed that slam dunk. Try to get back in it, but it won't work. Our next game will be the... Uh, so it will be the Atlanta Hawks taking on against the Charlotte Hornets. And it, it will be their, uh, it will be the uh, new players that we're seeing. Neil Walker, Tony Parker back in, but he got traded from the Spurs. Claimed it back in, Mitchell! Look how this is happening. He's like, man, no buckets for that field. Hayward again. He's got it again. Two times, two miss, two, for the two score baskets. That's it. That's a how deal that is. On the draw, O'Neal carries it down. Contact base shot. That would have 66 to 45. 
The Celtics have gone two or four from the field since we started. Now Hayward again. No, he missed the third time for in the fourth quarter. Now with 4 of 6 remaining, 12 rebounds and 18 rebounds for the Jazz. Ooh, must not have that one. Corfer. Corfer struck off again and didn't get the shot in the opportunity way. That's a shot he has to continue to take. And then after that, we'll see the Knicks. I'm well, sorry, the, uh, which one do I call it? You can't oh, that one. the yeah, crunchy dog first that we see. Just see the, um, this one called the, the um, I know which one I could finish, finish, use. It's hard the Sacramento it. Kings versus the oh, uh, Denver Nuggets against the, the Nikola Jozic team. Always we haven't seen anyone taking it on here. Yet. Just can't complete the play. Now Crowder will get back in. Looking for some screen action plays. Crowder feeling it out a bit. Field out. Robert takes that shot. 306 remaining. And after he assists, for those pick and roll six, now Rogier will come up. Big time finisher. Three minutes to go. So a couple timeouts are gone. Wolford missed the shot. Now he'll go over again. O'Neal. As you can see, O'Neal's getting a little tired at this point. O'Neal against Brown. Passes it to Gobert. Right over to Gobert. Brody, so Gobert, go over to Corfer. Corfer taking the shot. Is the it's good. And now you make that shot. No problem. 42%, 43%, 71% for the first time, and 75%. In the second half. Doing really well, keeping it better and better. One franchise, the Dallas Mavericks. Now Hayward will go up. Rogier take three. Missed the shot. Won't go back in. Two ten remaining. No points in the last game for two minutes and thirty seconds. Now coming to two minutes. Mitchell on shot. And then after that. We'll see the Bulls playing up against the Pacers. Look at this shot. Gobert made that shot with 11 points, and Al Horford takes with the 12 points. When you have a huge lead, there's the foul going on for Mark Mitchell for the blocking foul. He's like nowhere out between. What could he make done this job the last time? Well, there's no chance. Checked in for Daniel Tice. Smart comes in for Gordon Hayward. And Kyrie Irving subbed in for Rozier. Now Irving go back up. And foul called on O'Neal, number 23. That will be his first foul. And that was a tough, wise decision. Oh, I tell you what. How could you do it and reject the ball every other way? Well, I don't know. Probably don't know. Okay. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Now they get the bonus here. They need two shots before they get back on 50. Oh, starting to ignore it. Let's see. And he First one makes it through. And Greg was smart. When he's off the floor or injured, you notice just you see how Al Horford the team's out. defense. Yeah, Brown I mean, off. The defense overall really, just seems to have I can't less remember. Fight, Williams. Less edge, less and Mitchell, O'Neal, Crowder, and Gobert are subbed out. Played, Mitchell Long, like Crowder, Gobert, and Udo. And Eagles comes in. trying to slow his man down. Great at taking charges so and two, forcing turnovers. Two is truly the catalyst it's hard for their to do. defense. And now, coming down to 140, I got a text message for Eric that the Rangers take the win against the Blackhawks if you guys miss the game. But Udo, get out of the paint. Come on. Crowder. Shots off. Morris Senior. Ubiye. And a lot of times on bad teams, you see these guys going for numbers. Try to take it up uh, 50. Ooh, Ingles would have taken that over. Good Make a turnover. Smart. 
Good. On there the it is. Now he makes that 50. And as we head to the final buzzer here, a crushing It's like blow. hard impact here. All right, I'm going, going to call a timeout. As a gouty win for Utah. The biggest factor so, tonight had to be their great shooting. They shot much better than the other team. team. So yeah, the Rangers beat this black box with another close game, four to three. And if you guys don't even know, Rick Nash has retired from from the hockey. He played really well more than five seasons for the Rangers and nine seasons for the Columbus Blue Jackets. They were really so what a what a great job for uh, Nash he did. Thank you, Nash. You know, I you know I like when Rick Nash. He's a famous Rangers hockey player. What a night tonight. So one of you ready? You know, as the game tonight evolved, he really put the team on his back. He was aggressive, effective, and the defense, they weren't able to adjust. Well, the NBA has had three referee crews for quite a while. Steve, do you think adding a fourth ref would help in any way? No, I think it'll get a little yeah, bit crowded on the floor. Yeah. I would love to see. I know they won't go back. I love the They've been smart home arena. I look at it right now. Referee A calls it now. Now here's your Jordan player of the game that we are, will be coming up there soon. Here it is. The Jordan player of the game goes to Derek Favors with that three that you see. And there it is right there for the Utah Jazz. Making the pass over to Mitchell. And there it was. That is your Jordan player of the game, Derek Favors. Number 15. And now one on free left. This is how a game keeps better and better. Mitchell! Oh! That's the at least chaos we see. Mitchell, watch this. What a end up. And that is an unleashed chaos moment. And that is brought to you by Under Armour. Smart. Open, he makes a three. Hit again so from they deep. hit it again. And you can see where they were attacking the points. in the fourth. Strictly from the As you can see right now, it looks like the Hall of Fans. Works when you're not hot. good for the Celtics. Pick it up. Udo. You know the and the pass to Mitch, Mitch or Long. The reason why we want to make the city is that the Jazz had a hard time. So we want to change the sport a little bit. And we can get things better. Ubiye. Uh, Missed the shot, Rudy Gobert. Gobert. Mitchell comes up. More out of hand if they can 20 seconds. Wow, Kevin, what a Ingles, right up to it. Foul, called on Ubiye. And there's Ubiye. the call, foul on Boston. Joe and they call the foul on Boston. It's first, it's first, and defense foul. I mean, first, I don't know. Joe Ingles, here it comes. There, you see, ball, let that grip out. That's the foul. Okay, Joe Ingles, number two is going to give it a go for a shot. Okay, sorry we couldn't be able to finish off with the third quarter, but fourth quarter we did. First one falls. First forward. one's good. Incredible story how Joe. The Eagles makes that shot. No point. time to waste they it around. Let's get it go back here for the one last it. shot. It's been sacrificed. And now one more. That's all Shot's all good. good. 16 seconds and left. Only 13 the seconds remaining. Smart on the wing. Smart on the wing. No good. And that is it, fans. The game is over. And here's Gobert. Sorry. I'm not going to take that ball. I'm not going to take that ball. Your final score to the game's game, 76 to 53. Ruby Gobert's team for the win. And Kyrie Irving, what a desperate he is. He's having a hard, difficult time. But with that being said, that was a great game. The city of that makes the win. Great job. Let's catch up with him now on the sideline. From the sideline. On the sideline. We're taking a look for Derek Favor. Jordan Clear again. Is this the sort of defensive performance you expect every game? Oh, yeah, we can. No, no, they won't fight. Rebounds, three assists. And when we come out to the game, we can't bring it out either. 
Uh, it's a young team, young legs, and showed them at the defensive end tonight. Thanks, Derek. Back to you, Great Graham. job. Defensive oh, player tonight. Right. That's very good. Okay, fellas, I think you hope you enjoyed the game. Celtics versus the Jazz. If you want to see some more videos, please click the subscribe button below. I hope you enjoyed your uh, your season today, watching from the NBA action on telecast, part of the TNT, ESPN, or even on League Pass, also the NBA TV. And as for being said, we'll be right back for our next game soon. And we'll be right here with you to make the next game a little tougher. But the Boston Celtics are never always going to show what it is. And now, we're going to stay tuned for this game. And we'll see them back as we bring up for our next game. You know, you know, there's always a tough decision to make here. So, there's no always being such as the number one team. The Atlanta Hawks taking on against the Charlotte Hornets, Neil Walker. I mean, Kemba Walker. Neil Walker's from the Yankees. Kemba Walker. That's a little difference between Kemba or, or Kyle. I, I can't remember, but Kemba is different. So he's a part of a team from the Charlotte Hornets, and we'll see them later. And and of course, we'll see some uh, more more players as we see as we are taking a look for our second this game, the Sacramento Kings versus the Denver Nuggets against Nikola Josic's team. And Kings, tough to say, the Aaron Fox against Nikola Josic, and then. We will see the Chicago Bulls take it on against the Indiana Pacers. So with that being said, stay tuned for another NBA game action on NBA 2K19. And we will see you back once we'll get the uh, Pfizer Forum back with Janae's Auntie Dekumbo take it on against the Orlando Magics. But it's always that, folks. We'll see you on next time's game. And for that being said, peace out, people, for the wild the NBA 2K19. See ya until now. And we'll be back soon. This is NBA 2K19 signing out. Goodbye.